how am I going to navigate this new world that I live in? And it is up to me to make the decisions that will be either positive or negative. One, you are 100% in control of your life. Granted, you can't control what happens to you, but I can promise you, you are 100% in control of what you do with that. Success never has come about by just hoping for it. We have to be intentional with what we do. We have to be intentional with every choice that we have in front of us, and we have to be intentional with the decisions that we make. And teenagers going through one of the most uncertain times of their lives, that is when intentionality is so crucial. Your ability to make decisions. How to think about when somebody is making your life miserable. What do you think about that person? What's the story you guys are telling yourself? So my name is Kevin McKella. I'm a youth speaker. I'm a musician. I'm a former educator. I taught music K through 12. And that experience really being in and out of the classroom every single day, one-on-one uh, -on -one with kids and sometimes in a, a full ensemble of 90 kids with noisemakers, uh, taught me a very valuable lesson of what students are going through every single day, day in and day out. Sophia, give Sophia another big round of applause. So Bia, what I'd like you to do is I'd like you to hold this picture and tell me, is that picture heavy? No, of course not. So Bia, we're gonna pretend that this picture is your life. And now, we've got like a completely overflowing uh, picture. You notice she's shaking her arm? Why is that? Sophia, why are you shaking your arm so? This is heavy. Yeah, this is heavy. Do me a favor, hold your, bend your elbow put them back so you can get, some. okay, good, good. good. She's now two-handing it, so we gotta help her out. Sophia, put your life your problems down the table. <laughs> Notice, I didn't ask Sophia to put her picture down and walk back to her seat and completely ignore the problems. I didn't even ask her to ignore the stress in her life. I asked her to just put it down. And what did that do? that created a little bit of space. The value that he added to our program and the experience of our students is phenomenal. So cannot thank Kevin enough and absolutely hire him. Having Kevin come in and work with my students, I think it really connected with the kids because um, he was real and they can connect with something that's real. I would absolutely recommend Kevin's uh, presentation and just his presence in any program. It's already just in our school spreading. I tell my story of how I have made certain decisions in my life that led through uh, me becoming a musician and training at the conservatory. Um, and of course I incorporate music into the program. So I'll do live music. I'll, I'll bring in a couple of horns and not only are we using it to entertain and have a great time, but we're using it as a teaching tool. Every decision we make has three truths. Truth number one, our decisions stem from our story. If we tell ourselves a different story, we're going to change those decisions. Number two, our decisions have consequences. Right away, we can think about what those oftentimes negative consequences could be, but they could be positive too. And truth number three is the fact that our decisions are hours and hours alone. And that's really important for high school students to understand that they need to be held accountable, but they also get to be held accountable. So now what? What are you going to do every day? Decide to be the best version of yourself. No matter what somebody says to me, no matter what stress I have in my life, no matter what happens, I will always still bounce right back. Always. I know every single one of you in this room are off to amazing things and you have so much potential.